answer. Um, so, tell me, Patrick, what, tell me a little bit about your program. Okay, um, so uh, I'm Patrick Bonguet, the president of uh, Enjeu. Enjeu is an association uh, um, who, uh, in France, we say Loi 1901, law of uh, 1901, um, uh, which uh, can't make business can't make um, uh, money and uh, win money and uh, you win money no we can't you can't make fin financial income yes we can't have uh, income uh, all the money must be uh, uh, used for the association not uh, income uh, uh, prof uh, profit yeah yeah and uh, so we lead the French project, uh, uh, national. And uh, France, you know, it's a big country uh, with uh, uh, several uh, areas, mm -hmm. uh, 22 uh, areas. And after we have uh, the, the island and uh, uh, of uh, Caribbean island and uh, of uh, island in Pacific. Mm -hmm. So France is um, all this uh, this population. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so we're supposed to work with every every community. Community, Got yes. It. So now we. What do you refer to them as? Not states, but what? Uh, what do you refer to those communities as? Um, so we work uh, with association or towns, uh, cities who have a program with uh, homeless people. Just a definition of French of homeless people. We take the definition of the law. In France, uh, uh, we, con uh, uh, we consider that people who don't have um, material um, uh, uh, resource or uh, human resource, family, friends, to to, uh, to get an accommodation, not housing, but only an accommodation, uh, they're supposed to be homeless people. So, um, if you don't have family, if you don't work, if you, if you win not enough money, the average uh, income is uh, 500 euros. If you win less than 500 euros in France, we consider you 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 can't get uh, an accommodation or housing. So you you, um, you can have uh, you can get in the, pro, uh, the program the social program to get an accommodation. So. Uh, in French, we have a uh, uh, shelter, emergency shelter, I translate in France. Uh, uh, this is for people who, who sleep in, who, who are yeah. homeless uh, on, on the, the street, street. Yeah. on the street. So you get in emergency shelters, but the problem is what they said yesterday at the conference uh, and I agree with that a uh, lot of uh, most of people don't want to get to these shelters because uh, there is violence uh, it's um, I think those are the global issues in, in shelters yes it's too difficult to stay it's not safe. many problems it's not safe and you it's, can't get away yes. from the problems you're trying to escape yes yes so people don't get it after so this is for emergency you call 
115. Uh, it's a free call and they try to, to find you a situation. In Montpellier or in Toulouse, in big towns like this, when you call 115, you, you don't have place to sleep tonight. Uh, some people call every day and for a year they don't have place to sleep. Okay, after you have shelter who uh, have um, who, who do uh, social work. So you are you have accommodation um, and uh, you have a social worker who uh, work with you to increase your situation. You can stay uh, a year and after each six months you ask to the to the state uh, to the yes to the state the government you want to to stay again because your situation not uh, not you're not ready to go in uh, housing so uh, one year and after each six months you ask the states please can I stay again to extend it to yes and so this shelter we work with them we work what is the population what are the numbers in uh, average in France uh, uh, you are that you have access that uh, your your uh, access to uh, in France Fondation Abbé Pierre uh, where they support us uh, each year they give the, uh, a report about uh, homelessness in France and uh, bad housing so they consider from uh, 22 that then you have uh, 300, uh, 300,000 people, uh, um, homeless people in France. So you can consider people who, who, who sleep in the street, people who are in um, uh, squat, I would say, uh, housing mm -hmm. empty yeah, yeah, and yeah, they yeah, sleep yeah, 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 yeah. every uh, construction sites yes. wherever they can sit all they are in it and uh, and people who are in sh uh, emergency shelter okay so three hundred thousand uh, and um, uh, so uh, you have uh, politics who in France, uh, with uh, uh, COVID, the problem was all that you have confinement. But <laughs> the problem is how you can be confined if you sleep in the street. So uh, the government sent um, uh, uh, an opportunity for association to find to propose. Uh, an accommodation, uh, um, a housing yeah. for this kind of people, and uh, for example, uh, because I'm a social worker, and uh, the association. Uh, so how do you financially survive? How do you financially survive? Um, By the government? The, for Anjou? How do you How do you live? How do you survive? If they don't pay you, or if you aren't allowed to have income, uh, I I work for another association, Anjou, uh, our association. We are we Volunteer. don't we do yes, we don't um, uh, win money. How how much of your time are you committing? <laughs> Roughly, uh, <laughs> every day. Every I think uh, this is uh, by a uh, period. Sure. So, sure. But let's when, look at a week, seven days. So, if you were to say, yes, four uh, days a week, two days a week. Uh, we, uh, I work 
five day, five days, uh, three hours. About three hours a day. Three hours a day. Uh huh. Uh, every All time. year long. Yes. Uh, Got it. Five days a week. Okay. And uh, when we have homeless walk up, uh, it increased because uh, we make uh, okay. So we make we have several uh, partners. Yes, of course. Would you so, say that are they par are they sponsors? Uh, we have uh, sponsors, uh, several sponsors. But uh, is a sponsor and a partner different? Yes. So uh, can you explain the difference? Uh, okay. So the sponsors are uh, they give us money. So you have bank. We have two bank. Uh, National Bank and uh, we have uh, Fondation Abbé Pierre. This is um, a foundation uh, uh, created by Abbé Pierre. Uh, is uh, uh, he was uh, an important uh, man who done a lot of. Uh, he created Emmaüs. I don't know if you know Emmaüs. Um, and uh, Fondation Abbé Pierre, so both. So, um, uh, there, and after, we have uh, 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 after, uh, we have a, a partnership, with a partner who brings some money, like uh, Soccer de Rue, they participate because the, uh, this uh, this is the first time uh, this year uh, all the women come from Soccer de Rue and then they participate to uh, to have uh, some money uh, by the state by the town of Grenoble and so that they can uh, participate uh, financial uh, financially mm -hmm. uh, to uh, so um, about partners we have several partners in a lot of city in France uh, uh, for example in Grenoble we have two partners Soccer de Rue uh, with uh, Miriam Naoli and we have uh, CHRS L'Etat. CHRS, this is uh, shelters uh, with accommodation and social work. So um, we work with these shelters uh, since uh, 13. And uh, for example, the captain of uh, the team, the French team who gone uh, to Poznan in Poland was uh, uh, a guy from this shelter, this shelter. And um, so we, were, uh, we have some partner uh, shelter, some city uh, because, for example, in Rodez, uh, the homelessness is um, uh, the work is uh, made by the city, and uh, the city have shelter. So we work with the city. This is a town, uh, Rodez, uh, 200 kilometers from Montpellier. After you have uh, some uh, association, big association like uh, Caritas, uh, Secours Catholique in France, uh, Poitiers, we work with Secours Catholic Poitiers, and uh, I, I said you there is a lot of difference, uh, like partners for homeless World Cup between Mexico and us, or Norway, or Scotland, etc. Uh, we have not the same uh, level of. Uh, the game about the game because uh, Mexico have their project uh, a high project with a lot of uh, um, 
with a, a, a good selection and they train very hard to be very competitive. So uh, let, me, let me ask a question. I sort of want to redirect the conversation to as a club, as a bringing a club over here, being at these events many years, some, some positive areas and some negative areas in terms of ideas for maybe what you're missing or, or where you could use help, uh, assistance. Uh, Obviously, other than financial, but, but you know, uh, I think the relationships at the end of the day help the financial solution. So, uh, based on what I understand of different communities, I mean, the, obviously every country is different and politics are different. Yes. So, because I, your struggles are going to be different than Indonesia or yes. Africa. So, yes. so, in terms of what your, I mean, visas obviously is an issue. Right, the government being involved with visas to get these clubs over here. Yes. Tell a little, a little bit about your struggle. About you had teams set up, and can you elaborate on that particular story that you shared with me? Um, so we have the problem of visa because our work in France, uh, social work is for everyone who is who live in in the country. We don't see uh, national people and stranger people, all the same. Uh, since we have a lot of immigration, since uh, 10, I would say, uh, from uh, Africa, and uh, uh, it's uh, Africa and some uh, East Europa countries, um, uh, the immigration increase, and uh, uh, that brings uh, difficulties for, st for the government, each government. Uh, and uh, we, uh, we see that, uh, we saw that uh, players more and more were strangers because uh, they are more uh, competitive and when we organize tournaments. We organize one, uh, like uh, this year, we organize only one tournament, a national tournament, but we used to organize two or three national tournaments in, in uh, different town, towns of uh, France. Uh, we saw when we selected the, the players, we take, uh, we have 15 towns, uh, 15 associations who come to play and uh, we first uh, we invited only social associations or cities like I said who work with uh, homeless people. Now we know that we have uh, the, the population we want to, to target. And uh, after we do a sport uh, selection, so the best player we selected uh, about uh, for men about 30. And after we make uh, a training 30 and many trainings to arrive right at down. eight. Yep. Now we're down. For yep. the yep. for homeless select, worker. Select final selection. Yes. But we saw that uh, we usually uh, selected stranger people. And this year, to come to, to Sacramento, we have uh, uh, most of all were home, uh, strangers. Uh, Meaning not they didn't national, know them well. They tried national. out. They tried out. They were in the system. And approved to because of their requirements to participate if they made it. Yes, got it. Yes, and the problem after we we say okay, we will go. We will uh, not search national uh, uh, other programs people because yep. our program is to take the best, the best player, 
and so we say we will try to to get visa and uh, so there is several difficulties uh, because uh, you have uh, in all around the world they explain uh, the embassy explain uh, to us uh, clearly they were very they try to help us but they are they are uh, great difficulties because uh, the US uh, administration is uh, removed uh, restructuration so it was very difficult for them to um, to take us an appointment uh, to do an accept because you got a lot of students who must come in September in, in US to study and they don't have appointment until now it's a very very uh, big issue uh, and uh, this is not only in France they explain us so we don't manage to have a visa and I decided to um, not to uh, the, the men's team not to participate so so in regards to the young man that you said came can you talk about the young man yes so we have uh, uh, one man who prefer to go work because he asked uh, he find a job and uh, he want to come but there were only two so I said go work even though is a little uh, just few days yeah. but go work we will go next year and the other one i said okay come because we buy tickets yeah. and we can't how be... many tickets did you lose uh, uh six tickets do you know how much the cost of that was roughly uh roughly uh, because we paid 23 uh 23 000 euros and we lost so six tickets, maybe um, uh, 500 or 600 euros we lost. But uh, we try, we, we try with the uh, U.S. embassy in France, in Paris, to do the best. But so it uh, it uh, we don't success, and I know then uh, we can lose the tickets so it's so the last thing for now that I'd love to do is is if you could send a message to the folks from the homeless world cup and street soccer USA but let's do one at a time okay uh, a message to street soccer USA on your experience and anything else you'd like to say to them about Vita about about your experience and you know uh, a message to to them and to the community the street soccer world um, I think that uh, this is the first time uh, I, I know that that uh, sometimes there is some problem with some players uh, to come in the country when host homeless World Cup but this time we saw that the, the issue was big and uh, but I I know that uh, we can't do nothing because the uh, United States uh, state is bigger. So is it more but difficult to get into the United States? Is that what you're suggesting? It's yeah. more difficult to get here than other places for the homeless World Cup that you've gone to? Yeah, That's what you're saying? Because of this year, because right. of this period, I think uh, perhaps in a year, the problem will be uh, okay, and the restructu restructuration, the remove but of uh, the administration will hand, and everything will be okay. And uh, in a year, it, I think there is no so much difficulties. But so, so now, what I need you to do is send a direct message to Street Soccer and the Homeless World Cup. Individual messages, okay? So Street Soccer USA, your gratitude, your your appreciation, and you know, and, and if we can keep it a little consolidated, because um, I... 
Okay. Okay. Uh, so uh, uh, I saw like uh, each year uh, when uh, uh, Street Soccer USA do the best uh, to uh, to satisfy the the needs of the players, and uh, we see about uh, food. Uh, the food program. Yes, the food program. Yep. Uh, uh, at the beginning, it was, uh, uh, you know, in France, uh, we don't eat sandwich uh, <laughs> uh, too many uh, too many times in a, in a day. You can eat sandwich at the, at noon. But at the, uh, at the evening for dinner, you eat uh, a plate, and uh, this is the behavior of French people. And uh, uh, I saw that uh, uh, Street Soccer USA uh, and uh, Homeless World Cup try to satisfy the players to, to do the best they can hit well. Uh, yesterday evening, it was very, very. Uh, very good. Everyone was happy to hit. So, so let's let's try this a little differently. Send a message to the the people uh, that set up the food program. Send a direct message to them. Okay. Um, so I want to to mercy all the people who work about food program because I know it's very difficult and they do the best to change quickly to uh, what they're supposed, uh, what, what they're thinking uh, in order to satisfy all the players. And then The I, variety of food is my understanding that was so valuable because they're health eaters, vegetarians, right? Yes. So they had food for everybody and, and the masses amount of good healthy food? Yes, yes. It, uh, and the, it's a... Uh, um, a great work to try to satisfy everyone with uh, their own uh, behavior, food behavior. So it's uh, a, a very uh, uh, a good performance <laughs> to do this. I know how it's difficult. So the last thing I, I'd love to hear from you is together to the Homeless World Cup and Street Soccer USA, your gratitude Thank you so much, etc., etc. Okay. Um, um, okay. Uh, so uh, I'm very happy uh, to be here, and uh, the players are very happy to be here because uh, of the organization. Um, every, uh, every players and each organization, national organization, see uh, the work is done. For uh, to everything goes uh, uh, well, and so I'm very uh, proud of uh, the work of uh, the homeless workup. When I said you will see, it's a great, it's a great uh, event. So it is, and uh, I want to thank the homeless workup and uh, Street Soccer USA for the, the job they've done each uh, each day in Sacramento. Patrick, I want to thank you so much for your time, and it's been such a pleasure to get to know you and to now extend our family with each other. And I, I truly appreciate it, and uh, it's so important, the information you just shared. Yeah, okay. All right? So okay. thank you so much. Okay, no problem. Uh, so 